What was it? Uh, Robert Browning said it best. Uh, man's reach should always exceed his grasp, else what are heavens for? That says it best, you know? That's all the metaphors that have come down to us and all the stories and myths and what have you. They're all real. All the religions are real. Not real in a scientific, analytical way, but real that it is part of a human consciousness. Okay? And that's what I feel my drawings are about. They're all part of a certain type of reality. And it's reality of what's happening with a piece of material and a piece of paper. You know? Uh, just as much as you would read a passage of poetry or a passage in an essay or a passage in a short story or a passage in a novel that excited you. That's how I look at drawing. And so when I go and look at, uh, say, photographs and books of that of certain old master, oh, wow, look at that, you know? Look what's going on there. We usually don't see many films of drawings. We see people going through things, seeing, you know, the odd time they do a series, they do it on the paintings, right? But because of the color and everything, it really hits you with the color and the movement of the camera in and out to the painting. See, that's great. But they never show you the drawings. It becomes a flow. And uh, you don't argue with the flow. <laughs> you know? Uh, considering the thousands of people that want to be artists never ever get to be artists, and then of those, most never will find the flow. And in order to find the flow, you've got to create your own handwriting first. Because if you don't do that, you're playing the boho game of the art world, right? 